doppelganger drawing. Many people find drawing very difficult, so I developed this simple technique to show you how you might improve yours. What I want you to try and do is I want you to, to, to hold your fingers out like this in front of you. Um, and I'd like you to start trying to move them in synchronization. And what that means is so that if I move this finger there, that finger has to follow. And if I move it there, it has to move there, like a pair of windscreen wipers. And I want you to try to be as accurate as you can so that they're moving in perfect time with each other. And then we can change so that we're starting to move in different directions. We're trying to trick the fingers and trying to move them around together. And keep doing that for a minute. Yeah? Now how can that help us to draw? Well, let me show you. I've got a piece of paper here, blank paper, and I've got a photograph that I want to draw. And then I'm going to take my pencil, and my pencil is going to act like this second finger, so that when I move my finger, my hand is going to move directly in synchronization with it. And what I'm teaching you to do is to only look at the finger so that you don't need to look at what your drawing hand's doing. You can eventually, after practice, trust that your drawing hand is going to do whatever this finger is doing, like that. So this is how we can improve our drawing through a simple doppelganger drawing technique.